So, this is Heather, Dan's mom. We're here at a park that we frequent um, where I try to get Dan out um, a little bit out of our out of our home setting. He's a fearful dog, um, and I think people sometimes forget um, just how fearful he is. So this is this is um, where we come. This is a, a late afternoon walk. So uh, with that, I'll show you how Dan gets out of the car. He needs tons of reinsurance. Reassurance, sorry. Yep, and that's pretty normal for him. Come on, buddy. Wanna give it a try? Good boy, come on. Good boy, lots of reassurance. Good job, Dan. He's always nervous at first in any new environment. We never use any kind of um, aversive training methods with Dan, being a fearful dog. We just wanna build up his confidence and let him find his own way and just reward and praise. So here he's going. Good job, Dan. He's always on the lookout to make sure there's no people around. We are, as you can see, we're the only ones here on this path. And this path is so great because as we get deeper in, it's surrounded on both sides by water. So if he gets spooked, there's nowhere he can really run off. Um, and he is trained that if he gets afraid and needs to run back to the car, he'll just circle the car and wait for me. Um, so that was one of the first things we taught him when uh, he moved home with us. Oop. And sometimes he runs back to the car a couple times and I have to work on getting him out here. But it looks like he's doing well today. Come on, Dan. You can do it, bud. Good job. Good job. Oh, he's doing great. His tail's not tucked, which is great. Come on. Nope, we're going this way. You can do it. Handsome. Oh, he's just going over to sniff something. Handsome. Come on, buddy. You don't need to go back that way. We're going to go out for our walk. So we'll just get on this side of him. And he'll feel a little more comfortable going in that direction. Come on, buddy. This way. Come on. Good boy. Whoop. And he's back to the car. So we'll try again. Handsome. The way to make progress with fearful dogs is a lot of patience. Moving at their pace. Handsome, come here. Oh, well he's going to the bathroom. So we won't show that. Oh, great job, buddy. Yeah! Love those little bursts of confidence. So I'll get moving a little faster here. Come on, Dan. And we just play a lot of me walking ahead of him and me crouch, crouching down and encouraging him to get to me. He'll run past me and then stop. Then I'll move ahead of him. Come on! And it's basically a walk in slow motion. Come on, Dan, you got this. Yeah. Great job. Great job. Oh, it's okay. That's just a noise. Come on. That's just a noise. Yeah. And I love it when he can kind of collect himself back and continue on. A lot of times he will plant, kind of lowering himself to the to the ground and trembling if he hears some sort of a loud noise. And that's why we come to this park, you know, late or early, so there's less chance that we'll encounter people. Other dogs give him confidence, but people shut him right down. Handsome! And we're marking everything, which is fine. Handsome! Come on, bud! Yeah. And this walk is for him, not for me, so we're going to go at his pace.
Come on, you. Come on, you. Come on. Handsome, what are you doing? Come on. Good job, bud. Dan has, we have a bit of trouble getting Dan the amount of exercise that we'd like him to have. Um, he's very limited. He can't walk on a leash in our neighborhood. He just plants and trembles and just kind of refuses to go. The worst thing that you could do with a fearful dog would be to force him or pull him along. We don't want to flood him. Um, we're hoping that he'll find the confidence on his own in very short, short bursts of successes. Like this. He's so much better than he was when he first got here. So we know we're on the right track, and if he never progresses any farther than this, that's that's okay too, because he is who he is. So anyway, this is me and Dan out on our evening walk. Very quiet city park here in Providence, Rhode Island. Handsome, come on. Good job, buddy. Have a good night, everybody.